From UFOs to ghosts and psychic powers, history is riddled with unexplained events. You can turn back now and learn the stuff they don't want you to know. Here are the facts. Today, Christmas is one of the world's most widely recognized holidays. To Christians, this is a holy day commemorating the birth of Jesus Christ. Plenty of non-Christians also observe Christmas as a secular celebration of family. Some Christians fear the modern traditions have strayed from the day's original purpose. For example, the substitution of the phrase Happy Holidays or Merry Xmas for Merry Christmas is often presented as evidence that there is a war between the secular and the religious over the significance of this day. And, to a degree, it is true that the modern Christmas has become removed from its roots. But what exactly were those roots to begin with? Here's where it gets crazy. Most experts believe the first written mention of Christmas as a holiday occurred in 354 CE. In an illuminated manuscript known as the Chronography of 354, modern Christmas traditions have numerous roots and not all of these are Christian. In fact, some predate Christianity entirely. Consider the date commonly associated with Christmas, December the 25th. Scholars such as Andrew McGowan believe the historical Jesus Christ was not likely born during this time. However, there were pre-existing celebrations around this time of year, including the winter solstice and the Roman Saturnalia. In the 4th century, church leaders chose December 25th as the Feast of the Nativity to rival solstice celebrations. Additionally, the cult of Mithras celebrated their Messiah's birth on the same day. By the 9th century, this feast became a full-fledged holiday, complete with heavy drinking and riotous behavior. By the late 18th century, Christmas had begun to transform into the modern holiday, and today people around the world celebrate Christmas in different ways. Some of our modern traditions, such as the Yule Log, also derive from non-Christian sources. The Christmas tree, mistletoe, and Yuletide Log are all modernized forms of earlier non-Christian or pagan traditions that have been incorporated into today's Christmas celebrations. But what about Santa Claus? Unlike many aspects of the modern Christmas traditions, Santa Claus does have Christian roots. The modern Santa Claus is very loosely based on Saint Nicholas, born in Turkey around 270 CE. Saint Nicholas had a reputation for generosity, and in various stories he's shown providing protection, food, or gold to the needy. The practice of hanging stockings along a mantle comes from one of these stories. It's said that when St. Nicholas threw gold into the window of a needy family, he either wrapped the coins in a stocking or tossed the gold into stockings drying on a mantle. Given that Christmas originates from such a diverse collection of traditions, it's no surprise that certain aspects of the holiday have been considered controversial. Some researchers, such as David Pack, argue that since current Christmas celebrations are a form of syncretism or the melding of different belief systems, they should not be celebrated. Others, such as commentator Bill O'Reilly, believe there is a war on Christmas waged by secular forces that want to marginalize the religious side of Christmas and emphasize the economics, in other words, to focus on purchasing presents. Regardless of where you fall in this range of opinions, it's clear that the topic is controversial. Numerous people believe that, when it comes to Christmas, there's something they don't want you to know. But here's the problem. No one can figure out exactly what it is. 